it on. Wait, please, come on. Turn it on, fiction, my ass. Everything you have written, you've actually done. No. All right, then. Read this aloud and tell me what's true. It's my writing. It's private. I don't care. You can't be private anymore. Tell me the truth. Give it to me. Who the fuck do you think you are? Who the fuck am I? Who the fuck are you? You know who I am, Nate. I'm the woman that fucked you in a closet at an airport a couple of hours after I met you. That's who I was the day we met. Did you really fuck those two guys? You had sex with two women once. Not when I was engaged to you. You only had sex with one woman when you're engaged to me, without a condom. Oh, yeah. Where'd you fuck them? Did you fuck them in our bed? Why didn't you break up with me? Jesus Christ, I don't know. I don't know why I did it. I fucking wish to God I did. Did you fuck your brother? Oh, right. Go there. Why not go there? Did you? Did you fuck the rabbi? I know you wanted to. No. I bet it was because she wouldn't. Just for the record, you did it in Seattle before I did. Yeah, you know what? I was fucking scared to death. I just had a fucking seizure. Ooh, another thing you wouldn't have told me about if you weren't forced to. I felt safe with her, which frankly is something I have never felt with you. Oh, you felt safe with her? Yeah. Yeah, because you were leaving the next day. Oh, God. Nate, you created a human being. There'll be another person on this planet now, a person who might have a totally fucking miserable life and curse the fucking day she was born because you are walking out on her the same way you'll walk out on me. Oh, fuck you. You know what? Life doesn't have to be miserable just because you are. Yeah, I know. Weird shit happened to you. You know what? It happened to all of us. But I am sick to death of you using it as an excuse to act like a fucking cunt from hell. How long have you hated me like this? Oh, I don't need to hate you. You do a pretty damn good job of hating yourself. You picked me, you know. Yeah. Because I didn't know how fucked up you really are. Oh, that's bullshit. You knew and you loved it because it made you feel good about yourself. Oh my god, you are so full of shit. You just can't see it. Because you're so in love with the idea of Nate the good guy. Nate the hero. Nate the fucking saint with the fucking great haircut. The truth is, you'd run from real love if it ever came at you. Real love? What? You know what real love is? And the neediness and the ugliness and the responsibility. You would fucking run and you know it. The only reason you stayed with me is because I was never really here. Well, you know what? You could take your fucking ugly ring. Don't you throw that ring at me. That's such a fucking cliche. I'll fucking barf. There. Barf.